and good morning, good evening, good afternoon students and readers all around the world. This is Michael, the FX Freedom, and this is the professional forex trading course 101, right? Happy Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. This is our last lesson of the week. Never forget everybody trading is a learnable skill when we learn in the correct way. Also never forget that you're going to graduate. Bo, sound check, sound check. Can you hear me all right? Also never forget everybody that, that you're going to graduate from this course when number one, you have your chart set up and ready for trading. Number two, you have your strategy in place. You understand why you win, why you lose. And number three, you have a complete understanding on how this market works so you can analyze the market and make an educated prediction. Hello Fernando, how are you? And everybody, you can follow me on YouTube, it's youtube.com slash C slash FX Freedom FX or you can see the Freedom Lifestyle, right? On Instagram, okay, what Forex trading can do for you. Trading is a learnable skill. You can see the freedom lifestyle, right? I'm building a new, new. I'm building a new Instagram. Everybody talking about this. If so, maybe some of you are new to the show, to the stream, right? I need help, everybody. So this was. This is. I've said this already, if you can collect concepts, golden nuggets, trading concepts, charting concepts, right? Shola did this, uh, the others are doing this, first come first is served of course. Now I need a new help, if you know, hello Wala, how are you? If you know or if you are everybody, we need the social media manager, alright? If you know how to operate Instagram, Facebook, you know, whatever, okay, I'm, I'm more or less ignorant on this side, all right, everybody, or if you knew, send him or her to me, all right? Fernando says very well, Clara says hello everyone. All right, everybody, today we're going to work on number two, you have your strategy in place so you understand why you win and why you lose, and never forget for questions or homeworks, you have my Gmail and you have Skype for classes, you know, trading sessions and so on and so on and so on. Before we start the Forex trading week, everybody, now let's go here and open classes, right? Boss, can you repeat please? Yes, I need a social media manager. Okay? If you are a social media manager, everybody, or if you know somebody, you know, I can give you the Forex course 202 for free. Or if it's your friend, then send to me, we're going to talk about the money, you know, how much it's going to cost, and so on and so on and so on. All right, everybody. What is your strategy so so far? So far. So far, technical, technical, technical knowledge about the market. Technical knowledge about the forex market. All right? We've learned about the monthly monthly bands. Monthly bands. We've learned about market, market, wave. We've learned about, we've learned about the short term trend. We've learned about tre trend lines and city, city counter, counter, counter trend lines. All right, now we've learned about support slash resistance slash pivot point. All right, what is your strategy in order for you to count to the Forex course 202 that it's not for free with the understanding so far you are acquiring technical knowledge about the forex market, how this market works. 
We have learned about the monthly bands, market wave, short on trend, trend lines and counter, trend line support, resistance pivot points, uh, short term to edit label. You've learned about short term trends, short term trends, uh, and consolidation, right? And now you have your strategy, your strategy. All right, everybody. We have a workshop, an advanced workshop. This month it's over. Next month we have an advanced workshop. How to build a strategy that works for you, right? So your strategy is going to have entry rules. Is going to have general rules general rules what patterns patterns what patterns are you going to trade and on what time frame then you have entry rules you know how to enter the pattern how to enter the pattern then you are going to have trade slash risk management management trade or risk management rules it's not or it's and trade and risk management trade management okay Thank you very much. Trade management rules, risk management rules, and then you're going to have exit rules. Okay. I'm giving you a small workshop today, everybody, for free. Sounds good. Sounds good. You are hard working, you are eager to learn. This is my gift to you today. You have a small workshop right now. Okay, your strategy, general rules, what patterns are you going to trade and on what time frame, entry rules, how to enter the pattern from the general rules, then you have trade management rules, risk management rules and exit rules. So this is going to be number one, number two, entry rules, number three, trade management rules, number four, risk management rules and number five exit rules wow uh, mini workshop sure we have 50 more minutes right <laughs> it's a workshop okay everybody something that you do all right all right now everybody type in the chat define your general rules i'm going to do the same all right do this with me everybody take a pen and paper word document or in the chat and type in the chat define your rules meaning what patterns are you going to trade and on what time frame three two one go okay type in the chat i'm going to do the same so i'm inventing my strategy right now okay number one general general rule general rule general rule i am going to trade the market wave from the daily chart and which trade the market rate from the daily chart all right and what else so we learned about the monthly bands market wave short and trend and consolidation trend lines and counter trend line support resistance pivot points i'm going to trade the market wave oh what else what else did we learn everybody we've learned about multiple time frame trading right support resistance pivot points and we learned about multiple time frame trading hello benny how are you Ben, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. General rule, I'm going to trade the market wave from the daily chart. 
So I learned about the uh, short term trends. All right, all right, all right. I'm going to read the market wave from the daily chart and okay and star star star. You know, I'm going to trade the short term trends, short term trends from the daily chart. Just an example. Yep. Yeah. It's boss. What about the time frame? It's up to you. It's up to you. All right, everybody. You are. You need to. You've learned so far monthly bands market. But monthly bands on the monthly chart. You've learned about the market wave on all time frames. You've learned about the short term trends and consolidation on all time frames. You learned about trend lines and counter trend lines on all time frames, and you've learned how to understand and work with support, resistance, pivot points on all time frames. Now it's time for you to decide. We're going to keep increasing this one until December when this course is going to be over. And you are going to be welcome to join the advanced institutional course. All right, the advanced course. <coughs> but as we say, you are going to graduate from this course, Forex Course 101. When you have your chart set up and ready for trading, when you have your strategy in place, all right. So we are here working about on the strategy. General rule: I'm going to trade the market way from the daily chart. I'm going to trade the short and trends from the daily chart. All right. Now, star, star, star. If I have a job or a profession, right, and I cannot be I cannot see the charts multiple times during the day. Then I'm going to respect and work only on number one. Make sense, everybody? You must execute your strategy. Don't type in the chat rules that you cannot execute. Does this make sense to you? Fair enough. So, general rule, I'm going to trade the market wave from the daily chart. I'm going to trade the short trends from the daily chart. Okay, so this is edit label. And if I don't have a job or profession, if I don't have a job or profession that sucks me all the time. Fair enough. Boss, why this language? Well, you want to be free, right? Everybody, go to my YouTube channel. You're going to see time and money freedom. You want to be free. It's not just the money. It's time too. Make sense? Freedom is the battle cry, everybody. So if I don't have a job or profession that sucks me, the, the sucks all the time. Uh, maybe my language not appropriate today, you know? That sucks. All... Okay. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry, everybody. Pressure. That... Well, how can... How can we phrase this to be better, right? Yeah, I'm sorry, everybody. Offensive language. I'm sorry. Forgive me. If I don't, that... Will... That will... Take all the time better right ah there you go see my english it's improving all right i'm going to trade the short on trends from the daily chart if i don't have a job or profession that will take all the time right all right all right all right okay, everybody so type in the chat don't be don't be scared you know there is no right or wrong Type in the chat what is your general rule. There is no right or wrong. Boss, can I trade can I trade double tops, double bottom, triple tops, triple bottoms? Can I trade the market wave short and trend? Can I trade everything? Sure. Yes you can. Yes you can. Hedge fund trader Allah, what is your general rules? Hedge fund trader Fernando, what are your general rules from the strategy? 
Hedge Fund Trader Clara, what are your general rules? Hedge Fund Trader Benny, what are your general rules? Type in the chat everybody. There is no right or wrong, don't worry. The workshops are once per month. Okay, next workshops are next month. All right. Next one, number two, entry rules. How to enter the pattern. So, in number one, I'm stating everybody, I'm going to trade the. So, let's focus on number one, right? Broto says, I'm going to trade star, star, star. Okay, so. No, there is no right or wrong. This is just an example. Make sense? We don't have a lot of time, everybody. This is a mini workshop, right? So I'm going to focus on what is in the rectangle. I'm going to trade the market way from the daily chart. Now, I need to define number two. All right? How to enter the daily market wave? So number two, entry, entry rules, okay? 2.1. I will enter only only extension extension trades okay I will enter I will enter I will enter only extension trades 2.2 I will enter at and of retracement 2.3 I will enter I will enter with the CTB stands for counter trend line break all right candlestick formations we didn't okay 2.3 2.4 I will enter I will enter only if the trend line supports me all right so i'm building up my strategy everybody this is general to come on out this one all right and out 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 this one out this one all right Enter rules. I will enter only extension trades, meaning I'm not going to trade retracements. I will enter at the end of the retracement. I will enter with the counter trend line break. I will enter only if the trend line supports me. All right. Everybody, any questions in number two? Is this clear to you? Okay. Number one. You must define what patterns are you going to trade and on what time frame. Can we check mine? I'm going to trade the market wave on the daily chart. Did I define the pattern? Did I define the time frame? Type in the chat everybody yes or no. Okay. If we have time we're going to talk about the shortened trend too, alright? And number two, I need to define my entry rules. How to enter the pattern. So my entry rules are I will enter only extension trades. I will enter at the end of the retracement. I will only I will enter only with the counter trend line break. I will enter only if the trend line supports me. Fernando is saying daily chart market wave wait for the end of retracement or market wave check all the at the one hour time frame to check if the market wave starts to make higher highs and higher lows. Enter the trade after the break of counter trend line, stop loss and take profit as learned in the past lesson. Okay, everybody. Thank you, Fernando. All right, now, as you can see, everybody, my entry rules are a little bit different than Fernando's, right? 
Okay, now. Oh, clone chart. Let's go on Euro USD, everybody. Euro USD. Euro. Euro USD. Euro USD. Just an example, right? Euro USD daily chart. Euro USD daily chart. So extensions, retracement, extensions, retracement, extension, retracement. It up and Leslie was down, right? Okay. So market wave. The market wave. Extension, retracement. Okay, everybody. So yellow and there you go. Remember, this is just an example. Okay, this is just an example. All right. So this is the market way from before. Okay, everybody. Or let's give it a better chance. Okay. This is a lower low, right? This is a lower low. Everybody, is the circle a retracement? Yes or no? In the workshop, we have rules. Your, strat your strategy must be easy to understand, easy to obey, and easy to execute. If you don't understand your strategy, then you are not going to execute your strategy in the correct way. Does this make sense to you? And if you don't execute your strategy in the correct way, then you have no clue why your strategy is winning and why your strategy is using. Does this make sense to you? Okay. Now, is this circular retracement on the market wave? Yes or no? Type in the chat everybody, yes, this is a retracement or type in the chat, no, this is not a retracement. Alright, you can have the Lambo, I promise you, you can have the Lambo, but you must learn in the correct way. Fair enough. Type in the chat, yes, the circle is a retracement, or type in the chat, boss, I cannot see. So let's make it bigger. Is the circle a retracement on the yellow market wave, or it's not? Type in the chat, yes it is or no it's not. Can I have the Lambo? Yes you can, but you must learn in the correct way. Boss, can you repeat please? <clears throat> Your strategy must be easy to understand because if you don't understand your strategy you are not going to execute your strategy and if you are not going to execute your strategy properly you have you can you are not going to understand why you are winning why you are losing Broto Fernando Julius and Ala you are back in the first class. This is not a retracement. This is... <laughs> somebody just like, oh, I knew it, you know, he's going to trick us. This is not a retracement, everybody. Go back to the first class. Kindergarten. Kindergarten for all of you. See why the workshops are good? To show you how much did you learn? This is not a retracement, everybody. Pay attention. What is the definition of an extension and what is the definition of a retracement? Ala, Julius, Fernando, Broto, type in the chat. What is the definition of the retracement? 
How do you know that the retracement started? Oh no! Yes sir! Kindergarten again! First class again! Primary school again! Go back to Dukas Copy YouTube webinar page or my channel YouTube and start to watch lesson number one. Oh no! Yes! Everybody, you must understand that this is serious business. Alright? Now, some of you might be new to the channel, it's alright. But for some of you, like Julius and Ala, those kind of mistakes are not acceptable anymore. Fair enough? This is not a retracement, why not? Because you don't have the higher highs. Everybody, do you see the change in the shortened trend in here? Is this the change in the shortened trend? Do you have a minimum too hard highs, too hard lows? Type in the chat, yes we do or no we don't have. Come on man, boss please, if it's not a retracement then what it is called? Start to make car highs higher low. Well, let's see. Let's see everybody, let's dive in. Oops. Uh, where is the... There you go. Let's see if Fernando is right everybody. Okay. Start to make car highs higher lows. Alright, Fernando. Rectangle. Everybody, do we agree that the rectangle it's a, it's a low? No, we don't have exactly. Is the rectangle a low? Yes, it is. Right. Now, where is the high? Is this a high? No, it's not. Is this a high? No, it's not. This is a high. You have one low and one high, everybody. To be a retracement, needs to have a minimum of two hard highs and hard lows. Exactly. Julius and everybody else, not Julius, you know. Alright, so I have a strategy and if I'm going to enter here thinking that this is a retracement, which is not, and I'm going to put my stop loss above in here, I have a strategy I have a strategy on the left side but I'm not trading this strategy does this make sense I'm making what are called traders mistakes need to have two candles on the left and two candles on the right yes sir all right everybody you are doing, which is okay, you are here to learn, but those kind of mistakes for some of you are not acceptable anymore. Alright? What do you mean, boss? Get serious! Get serious, you are not studying. You know, or maybe you don't pay attention, or maybe you are not focused. Make sense, everybody? Those classes are for free forex course 101 but just because it's free you know this is serious business make sense most of you that when you come to the forex course to to the advanced course have issues and problems from the forex course 101 why because you didn't take it seriously make sense everybody if you think that this is a joke and please don't take me as an arrogant person because I'm not Clara and Allah and Julius in here they know me I'm not arrogant all right but if you don't if you cannot understand that this is serious business then then what you know oh the market is against me and I'm never going to make it no 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 we as traders are the only issue we are the problem and we are the solution 
Make sense everybody? So I must understand my strategy. Okay, so this is not an entry. Alright, from the strategy. And somebody just started, I was waiting for this one. Boss, but it won. It was a winner, boss. It was a winner. You are not going to understand everybody. You are going to understand this in the Forex course 202, the advanced course. Yes, this was a winner, but it's not a winner from your strategy. Does this make sense to you? Everybody? There is no right or wrong. You must obey. Oh, boss, can I do this? No. No, you can't. Everybody type this down. This is the most important thing that you are going to learn today. Every single time. Every single time that I enter a trade from my mind slash head. Okay, and it's a winner. This is bad for you, not good. This is bad. This is bad for me because I have no clue of the process that made my winner. Does, I mean, I'm not going to ask you, does this make sense to you? It's not, right? Every single time that I enter a trade from my mind or the head or whatever, and it's a winner, this is bad for me. Not good, because I have no clue of the process of the rules that made my winner. Make sense, everybody? In the advanced course, you are going to connect the dots and everything is going to start making sense to you. If you hide the future, you know, if you hide the future, you have highs and lows, so not talking about the shortened trend and uh, the market way, but talking about the shortened trend, you have high to low, low to high, high to low, and then you have a higher high. Agreed everybody? The market just made a higher high. You have a 50% uptrend and you are shorting the market. It's easy to say, oh, but it was a winner. This is bad for you, not good. But is that a winner? You didn't know at the time of the trade. Make sense? You cannot speculate. You have, so this is my gift to you and it's not easy to understand, believe me, I know. This is the gift. You must follow and understand the process. And when you win, you are aware, you are conscious, you know how you entered and you can explain your winner. This is how professional traders are groomed. And when you lose, same story. You can explain the loser too. So when you do something like this, you are not executing the entry from the strategy. This is bad. But I made money. Yes, you made money, but you have no idea how this money was produced, is it? And I have another, we can, we can check another reality check. Your my FX book and your numbers are showing to you that you are not consistently profitable. And you are not consistently profitable because you didn't execute the strategy. You did something different. Can you understand this everybody? Type in the chat, yes I understand, or type in the chat, no I don't understand, or type in the chat, it's difficult to understand.
Clara, the, is this lesson helping you to understand what is happening in the New York session every morning with Israel and Araldo and everybody else? Okay, some traders are sleeping there from Australia and Singapore. All right, some traders are in a job or a profession, they're going to watch the recording. Fernando is saying strategy must be well defined and followed or no new Jeep compass. Clara says yes. All right, everybody. Most likely you are not you don't believe me and it's okay. You are going to understand at the end of the year. Okay? If you don't believe me, it's all right, you know? I've been there too, been there, done that. But once you're going to trade, if you are smart on the demo account from one year, two years, three years, and you are not going to be consistently profitable, then you are going to start to open your mind to this. You know, I've learned all the concepts and the rules and you know what's wrong. Financial markets are upside down. This business, you can ask Clara and Julius, they're in the advanced courses. This business is not what you think it is. You are not going to catch a fish in here and you are not going to chase a rabbit in here. Make sense? You can get lucky once, but you are going to give it back exactly the same, if not more, to the market. Because you have no idea about the process. Alright. So, I'm still the trader who is trading the market wave now the kindergarten traders is this a retracement everybody is this a retracement is this a retracement yes or no type in the chat yes it is a retracement or type in the chat no it's not a retracement Now, somebody is typing, boss, but the daily chart takes forever. You have no choice if you have a job. Fair enough. I agree with you. The daily chart is going to take forever. I agree with you. Believe me, I feel you. I agree with you. But if you have a strategy that says, oh, I'm going to do this on the one hour chart, two hour chart, four hour chart, you are not going to be able to execute. Does this make sense to you? Because you have a job. Make sense, everybody? That there is going to be a setup and you are, it's not personal. This is how life works. You have a job, a business, a profession. There is a setup on the smaller time frame. And you didn't see it. You didn't enter. You couldn't. How could you? Make sense? And remember, you are learning a skill. You are not doing this for the money. If you are doing it for the money in the beginning, you have the wrong motivation. You are learning a skill. Okay, no, 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 Julius, yes. Jordanka, Broto, and Clara, back to kindergarten again. This is a retracement, everybody. Low to high, high to low, low to high. Right? Do we have a change in the shortened trend? Yes, but there is no yes, but those are the rules. The change in the short term trend is going to show you when it's a retracement. So this was not a retracement and you said yes. Now when this is a retracement, you said no. Back to first class again. 
kindergarten for all, all of you boss but how do I know simple rules the change in the short-term trend the change in the short-term trend is going to show you extensions and retracements yes but there is no yes but period end of story Make sense everybody? How do you think investment banks and hedge funds they give the same strategy to 10 traders and they have the same results? The rules are black and white not subject to interpretation. Market moved up, yes, not a retracement. Market moved up, yes, this is a retracement. Because you have minimum two higher highs, two higher lows. Higher high, higher low, exactly. Alright, so from my strategy now, from my strategy, now this is the market. From my strategy now, I have a setup. General rule, I'm going to trade the market away from the daily chart. I'm going to trade, this is for later. Entry rules. I will enter only extension trades, right? So let's wait. I will enter at the end of retracement, right? And okay. I need to get rid of this one. There you go. So we're going to put here extension trades and another rectangle, another rectangle in here and another rectangle here right okay so this is the market i don't see the future right but i'm going to draw a trend line or counter trend line give me a second everybody give me a second like this and like this right and remember this strategy just an example all right all right okay so can I enter at this circle type in the chat yes you can enter or type in the chat no you can't enter can, can you can I enter at the circle everybody wow that's cool Yeah, it's cool, right? Everybody, can I enter the circle? Type in the chat. Yes, you can or no, you can't. Or you know you better not. Can I enter in here, everybody? Look at my rules. Look at my entry rules. I will enter only extension trades. If I enter at this circle, am I entering an extension trade? I will enter at the end of retracement. If I enter at the circle, is this an end of retracement? I will enter with a counter trend line break. Am I entering with a counter trend line break? And I will enter only if the trend line supports me. Is the trend line supporting me? Talking about the trend line, before I enter, I need to draw trend lines, right? I need to draw the trend lines everybody and trick when you don't see the chart you go to the higher time frames right so this is the monthly chart and this is the long term down trend line maybe I can go to the weekly chart just to spatially see and understand okay this is one trend line and I have so far another trend line grid and now I'm going to go back on the daily chart which is my trading time frame come on give me a second and I need to find the entry so we are here so far okay now this is from the weekly and all right there you go back to the trade back to the initial trade this is what i'm seeing right i don't see the future 
exit full screen yes you can yes you can yes you can all right so I will enter only in an extension trade everybody how do I know that this is an extension trade How do I know that this is an extension trade? And I go, we're, I'm going to speed up because we're almost out of time of this mini workshop today. How am I going that this is an extension trade? I don't know. Because in order to be an extension trade, the market must change the short term trend. So I cannot check that this is an extension trade. I will enter at the end of retracement. How do I know that this is the end of retracement? It's a no go. I cannot check this one. Make sense? Oh, the market is going to fall. You are speculating. You are not trading from what you see. You are trading from what you think is going to happen. Enter with the counter trend line break. Everybody the counter trend line break it's on the pattern this is not a counter trend line this is the relevant one you've learned this too so it's no go no go no go no go i will only enter if the trend line supports me well we can check this one see how this goes everybody those are my entry rules strategy rules i cannot enter on the chart and you can apply this on all time frames by the way on extension not yet end of retracement not yet counter trend and break counter trend and break not yet so i need to wait everybody I need to wait patiently wait 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 bam now there is something different right so this is a high this is a high now this is a high and after the high we have a low now the story start to change right okay i will enter only in extension trades it's not confirmed yet i will enter at the end of retracement it's not confirmed yet enter with the counter trend and break now i can check oops now i can check it right counter trend line break do you understand everybody why you might have the knowledge but you might might not understand why are you winning why are you losing on your strategy why not boss because you are making traders mistakes you know the concepts in theory but when it comes to the chart you are not it's not personal i'm not judging you know it's it's we're all the same we learn the concept but when it comes to the chart we me and you we didn't practice enough so we are implementing the concepts and the golden rules you know 50 percent right 50 percent wrong you know or 70 percent wrong and we are thinking you know well, what the heck you know what's wrong with the strategy why i'm not making any money and john does john and jane are making money and i'm not or maybe i i have one winner but then i have five losers make sense everybody you've learned something in theory but you are not yet skilled yet okay and this is why you are producing results that you don't know how to explain so you are going to grow make sense everybody homework explain your winners explain your losers so i'm going to wait i'm going to wait i'm going to wait now now everybody do we agree that i have a high to low to high to low do we agree that we have a downtrend everybody do we agree 
did the shortened trend change direction? Do we agree that the market changed direction? And one more, right? What is your strategy? There is no right or wrong. I'm going to put one more here. Edit label 2.4, 2.5. Two point five. I don't bother with support resistance pivot points. Make sense, everybody? I don't bother. It's a rule. Boss, can how can you not bother? Because I'm on the daily chart. You know, everybody. If you are a day trader on the 15 minute chart, 1 hour chart, then you should bother with support resistance pivot points. If you are on the daily, maybe or maybe not, there is no right or wrong, it's up to you. You know? Yes. So, now that I have this one, this is, now here it's my entry. This candle here, it's my entry. This candle here, I will enter an extension. Market is extending down again. Enter at the end of the retracement. The market changed the shortened trend. So I can check all of those. <laughs> Not this one. Uh, give me some. You know, I can check all of those. So I can check this one. Alright. I can check the second one too. Now I'm here, we are almost out of time, I'm here everybody, give me a second, come on J4X, come on, come on, there you go, I'm here and, you know, I'm here, stop loss, stop loss above in here, right, stop loss above in here, or maybe not give me a second everybody those are the rules we've learned so far so it's made it made a lower low in here agreed everybody it made a lower low in here it made a lower low compared to so this low it's lower compared to this low based on the market wave rules this extension it's conformed so my stop loss goes up in here okay and then we don't have time but then I need to also address trade management you know and risk management and so on and so on and so on all right everybody can you do this can you do this and everybody if you need help ask for help make sense As Clara did, as Julio did, you know, next level number one. If you want quicker results and not waste one, two, three, four years to understand the Forex course 101, ask for private lessons, ask for private classes. And of course, number two, you know, don't stay where you are. All right? Go to Forex course 2, two come to the Forex course 2, two. All right, don't stay where you are. All right, everybody. Have a great weekend, everybody. See you back on Monday. Thank you very much.